Hello everybody. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Binding Blade. In the last episode, we got the last legendary weapon. And this episode, we are dealing with Zephyl. Finally! <sighs> After obtaining the Binding Blade, Roy directs his troops to Burn's capital. King Zephyl awaits within, along with his personal guard. Roy prepares to charge the castle to end the war and to bring a long-awaited peace back to Aline. So, let's not waste any fucking time, right? This map looks fucking insane. <laughs> um, we don't have to kill everybody, but it is highly recommended that you try and kill as many people as possible. So, this map looks a little weird. The objective is that we need to hit these like these these two heroes oh you've got a brave axe interesting you have a brave sword that's really cool uh these two heroes are on switches we need to uh put a unit on those switches and use them to be able to open this door i don't know if they have to stay there i don't think they do uh, but we need to use that to be able to open this door so even if we were to hit the middle which isn't too difficult with both sides of our team we wouldn't be able to do anything unless we hit those two switches. So, the plan is to kind of just rush it, just rush in, deal with what we need to deal with, and end it. There are going to be reinforcements on this map because, let's be honest here, it's, like, come on, it's, <laughs> it's the final, basically the final map. Reinforcements aren't gonna end. I'm actually saying that, uh, from turn 10, there will be two bishops every turn, well, every five turns until the 40th turn. Let's talk about what we've got real quick on our unit side, though. Uh, Gonzalez, Ray, Shin, Lance, Lilina, and Fur all have legendary weapons on them. I think that now's the time to be using them. Um, furthermore, I was, I was mulling this over. What I'm gonna do is for the next, the next four maps, there's this map, the next map, and then the two final maps. If someone dies, they're dead. It kind of sucks for us because, well, it, it both sucks and doesn't suck because I have so many good units or units that I've considered, but I think because this this game we've had what two deaths we had dorothy and someone else who i can't remember the entire time so i think now's the time to let people die final thing i just want to talk about how broken the binding blade is so first of all these are always stats right these are always stats right now 15 18 16 20 10 13 pretty good um Binding Blade increases defense and resistance by 5 points. That means that Roy has 15 defense and 18 resistance. For a lord, that's kinda gross. But let's not waste any more time. Let's get into the map. Chapter 22. An Undying Dream. Let's do it. What you're saying, then, is that Murdoch is dead. I am sorry, Your Majesty. What is the Etrurian army's next move? They have captured the Shrine of Seals. They march this way. Very well. Then we face them in the castle. Yes, my king. My life is yours. No, you cannot die here, Brunia. I have a task of brave importance for you. Huh? Eden. Where are you, Eden? Here, Your Highness. I will remain here and defend the castle against the Etrurian army. You must escape to safety and stay hidden until the battle is over. As your highness wills. Brunia, you will guard Eden. Protect her as you would protect me. No, your majesty. Please, allow me to fight by your side. That is something I cannot do. This will be a harsh battle, and Eden must survive. If she is lost, this entire struggle has been for nothing. I must object, your majesty. I serve you and you alone. Enough, Brunia. Your king orders you. The punishment for defiance is execution. 
Yes, Your Majesty. Eden, if I fall, the plan continues. As you will. The world will be liberated as per Your Highness's command. Good. Then my dream will be fulfilled. Of course, Your Highness. The Etrurian army. I will not let you into the throne room. I shall protect this witch with my life. This is the king's castle. Lord Roy, Zephyr is in the throne room in the center of the castle. However, the entryway to the throne is blocked off by automatic defenses. What can be done? One of the captives said that either end of the castle, there are some switches that can be manipulated to open the way. That will be a long detour. There is more. After hitting the switches, one must hold the fire emblem in front of the throne room to make it open. I have the fire emblem with me. Sounds like I should go to the throne room, although there's handle the switches. That would be the quickest way. Would a captive leak that kind of information so easily? Perhaps it's a trap. I don't believe so. The captive said the switches are protected by Burns' ablest warriors. Even with this information, it will be no easy feat. The enemy may be powerful, but we're not exactly slouches either. I know we're up for the challenge. Victory will be ours. And that is exactly what we're gonna do. Uh, saying that, I'm not actually quite sure how I want to play this. So... Let's just move. Let, let's, like, Roy and Lilina and Gonzalez are all staying together, basically. Because they have, like, the three-way triangle thingy. Uh, saying that, I think Lance and Clarine should stay with those two as well. Because Lance has a support with uh, Roy and Clarine. Um, I think that means Deke and Wendy... Actually, I think those two might be the only people we need to do this. They're kind of disgustingly powerful, so I wouldn't be surprised. But... Uh, okay, actually, if I put Deke there, can I, he'd get hit. No, okay, cool. Um, I'm not quite sure how I want to do this. Uh, considering the game said, let's have Roy, like, wait here, basically, until the switches are open, that's probably what I'm going to be doing. Um... Saying that, well, actually, Wendy, yeah, Wendy and Deke don't have legendary weapons on them, whereas these guys do. Like you do, Roy, uh, like Roy, Lilina, Fur, Gonzalez, and Lance all have legendary weapons on them. Uh, Melody and Zeiss are together because they're Melody and Zeiss. Um, the only two people, like, okay, I should have mentioned this map has 16 units, which means we've left three three people, I think, that we could have been using. Those three people are Wade, yeah, Wade, Geese, and a Green. I considered it, and I was thinking, well, of all my units, these guys, well, those three in particular, like, Geese is good at, you know, critting, but not much else. So I was like, okay, there's no point in dealing with that. Oh, fuck, I forgot to do something. Um, I just remembered. Damn it. You, no, not you. You have a Berserk Staff. That will suck. And it's almost definitely going to aim for Gonzalez, but I forgot to give you the Restore Staff. But you do have Hammer, which is really important. Uh, because it means that if we break, well, if we get close to breaking any of the legendary weapons in this map, uh, Clarine can heal up three of them before that breaks. If any legendary weapon, even if you have them all up to this point, break in this map, you cannot hit the other three maps that are hidden behind this. It kind of sucks, but it's just how it is. Okay, I was about to say, what the hell? And then the game's deciding what units it wants to move. Okay, that missed Clarine. I didn't even think they... I didn't even consider he'd try and hit Clarine with that. Um, I kind of want to put Roy into a fight. I want to see what he can do. Uh, but first, let's move. Well, let's watch where you can come. Okay. Let's move Wendy and Deke into here first. On the Slayer. Okay. I mean, maybe the flying unit should come and do this, actually. Because they can, like, get back the fastest. Huh. I'll do that, actually. 
didn't cons like I've only just considered that. I'll do that instead, I think. Who has the most HP? Oh, Zeiss does. Okay, interesting. Uh, Roy. I want to see what you like in battle, but I don't know <laughs> who to make you hit first. You still don't double. Still don't double. What's your speed again? 16. What's his speed? 14. 10. You can you can double the sniper. So let's do that now. With your happy ear. Killing Edge? I mean, Killing Edge could kill if it crits. Light brand. Okay, but let's not let's not waste too much time. I think let's just move far in first. Silver sword it. I'm not gonna. I, I'm gonna. Ooh. I'm not gonna speed up this map. I think I already have, but I'm not gonna because this is a very important map. So I think speeding up would kind of lessen the experience, you know? Wouldn't make it much fun. Oh, uh, if I put you there, can Rory still get around? Yes, okay. Right, this might be what we need, because this might, like, disgustingly boost up Rory. I'll put you there. Rapier. Yep! With all that put together, he has a 32% chance to crit, and he does. Oh my god, Roy. Jesus Christ. Um, so yeah, despite the Binding Blade being disgustingly powerful, I'm actually gonna avoid using it until we get to here, because we need to use- well, we don't need to use it, we need to equip it to open this door when everything's, you know, prepared. But also, I mean, all the people that have legendary weapons, I'm not gonna use them until we open this door. Because it's the final map. Dragons are gonna- well, um, the supposedly final map, if you don't have, uh, if you don't have all the legendary weapons. So, I'm just gonna, you know, make the assumption that there are gonna be dragons in there. Uh, and by make the assumption, I mean make a pretty, pretty educated guess. What do you have? You have silence. Ooh, that's annoying. I'm so scared of that Berserk Staff. I haven't worked around it yet, but I am very scared of it. Where can you move? Because I don't want Chad to get hit. Really. What do you have, actually? You have a Steel Sword. Yeah, you can probably deal with that. Yeah, you've got your Killing Edge equipped. Let's do that. I'll put Sin or... Let's put Shauna next to you, actually. Like this. And then... Uh, Chad can come around, open up a few, uh, chests, since that's why he's here. You know, see what's around. That missed. Deke is gonna double you because he's Deke. Destroyed. Maybe I should have given somebody a chest key on this side, but, eh. It's not really that necessary. <sighs> okay, that hit, that kinda sucks. How did we miss a 75? That's dumb. Thanks, game. Much appreciated. It's deciding who wants to move next. <laughs> Ooh, forgot about you. You have a devil axe. That better miss. Okay, it did. We might actually be lucky. I say that, but now that probably just jinxed it. He's got one more berserk left. I don't want that to hit us. Uh, what do you have, mister? You just have a steel axe. Oh, but axes beat lances, don't they? Shit. <laughs> Oops. Uh, Zeiss definitely cannot deal with one of these guys. I'll move Zeiss up here and equip him with a sword. And then move Melody up and equip her with the Javelin. Do this. Because if this guy hits, I can heal Melody. Uh, Clarine, sorry, has a Physic. And it did hit. Okay. But yeah, Clarine has a Physic. Um, she can heal that up. It's probably not going to fully heal her. But it's still, like, enough for it to be useful. Let's move... Let's move Deacon... Ooh, wait, what do you have again? You have a 
three of axe. Axes beat lancers, but they have swords as well. They're also not that fast, right? You have 14 speed. Well, you have 20. What does he have? 16. Eh? I'll move. I'll move Deke with them, but Mel but not Melody, but Wendy. Sorry, will come with us. Uh, let's just move straight past them. What do you have, good sir? You have a steel axe and a hand axe. That's fine. I know exactly where I want to put Lance then. Oh man, okay. Do that. Marine, come here. Physic. Use this. I know I said I wouldn't speed up. I'll speed up healing, because nobody really wants to see healing. Uh, fuh. Yeah. Ah, uh, why'd I just speed up? Sorry. Shouldn't have done that. Uh, it's kind of ingrained. I should... I'm considering just removing that button. Making it something I can't even hit. Or something I won't hit. I won't do that, actually. I'll just, like, program my mind to not hit that button. Okay, so next to Lance is safe. I was thinking, I was trying to, like, find where, where the safest place to put people was. Uh, this, this side is currently okay. Oh, uh, this side needs a little bit more help. Okay, so, first of all, Chad is kind of in a bad situation, but that's fine, because we can heal him. Sword. Sword is probably best bet. I don't know, let's move away. Let's use the killer bow. Well, I want Ray to get a little bit of action. Ray might actually heal Chad, so... Do any of your swords hit better than that? That does. Okay. Oh, come on, dude! Chad. 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 Come on, man. At least I can trust in Tate and Shauna to be able to do something. Jesus Christ, Chad. 70% and you're missing? That's like 80% and you're missing. Like, it doesn't make sense. Uh, anything up here that we really need to deal with? Not really. You kind of suck. Uh, but, you know. Can Soul Reach? No. Only Shauna and Sin can. Uh, in which case, what I'll do... I'll hit him with the sword. I want to see, because he might hit himself. He missed anyway. Okay. Uh, Shauna should have a javelin. Well, actually, Shauna has a sword as well. What am I talking about? Let's use the sword. It's there. May as well. Oh, please kill yourself. That'd be hilarious. Oh. I think it actually has to be able to hit. For it to, like, hit them back. You know? Uh. I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm... <laughs> I really don't know what I'm talking about at this point. Uh, do I want Ray to attack or to heal? I want him to attack, I think. There we go. Probably should have given you another Flux Tome, actually, thinking about it. Because that one's kind of broken, isn't it? Oh, no. Never mind. It's the Eclipse that I was looking at. Uh, and that's allowed to be that low, so... That's a bit of a waste of a staff. I'm not going to do that. Put him here to protect him. But I'm not going to waste a staff use. Because soul, sta uh, soul staffs are like... A, all healing. And B, made to be like, Hey, are you in trouble? Let me... Let me back you up real quick. Uh, Tate took a bit of a beating from that sword. But it's a Lance Reaver. I should have checked that, actually. Is that the only person that gets attacked this turn? No. Okay. As I suspected, he went for... Did the game suddenly change from true hit to... Eh. <laughs> Who cares? God. As I suspected, you came down. 
Uh, does it? Even though you don't- Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, even though you don't have it equipped, is the Maltec giving you that skill plus five? Because that wouldn't make much sense. Ugh. Okay, that has no chance of hitting. <laughs> Forgot about bows! Forgot about bows. Interesting! Fuck. Sake. Okay. No one is safe right now. Nobody. Well, actually, I say that. Uh, Shauna and Sin have decent enough. Oh, but then, see, here's the thing Saul can move however he wants. Man. I'll equip you with that because you can avoid with that. Do this. Heal. Just get past this. Okay. Sin, since you have the bow. That doesn't kill. Brave bow and then. Just get just get rid of people who are like who are kinda destined to be nuisances. Did we ever get a brave sword in this game? I don't remember getting a brave sword. And if I did, I broke it by accident. I really don't want him to come and get Chad, but I feel like that's who he's gonna come and get. And even if I had a recover staff, uh, Clarine was on the other side. Okay, let, let, let's, 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 let's do this. What's your speed first? 22. Okay, 23. Why is you, why are you so fast? Okay. Uh, might of 8 plus 20, that's 28. 28 minus 3 is 25. So Sin would survive. Shauna and Tate would probably survive as well. What do you have? Nothing that can hit over. You do, and you can hit Chad too. Oh, I should have checked that. Oh, and it's Fenrir too. God, if they both hit Chad, he's definitely dead. Yeah, Chad has two resistance. He has the chance to dodge, but he has two resistance. And Ray is gonna be fine. Even though it beats Ray's magic, he has 17 resistance, so it should be okay. I don't think I want to move Tate. My question is whether I want to move Shauna. I'm gonna move them next to each other. Like this. Because it mean at least that means he has to come around if he wants to hit Chad. Which he can do. Oh god. Um Six. Yeah. Deke, come around. Silver sword him. Any other enemies up here? Just the general that's blocking the way. Uh, Zeiss, you have more defense than your sister does. Right? Yeah, yeah, you have 17 and he has 23. Zeiss is basically a flying general. Um, which makes him disgustingly good. Uh, I don't want to save state. I think I'll only save state. No, I'll save state. I'm afraid, but I'll save state. Even though there's really no point in save stating where we are currently. Uh, no point in coming around this side. Let's just come down, I think, right? Yeah, let's just come down. Start dealing with the people around the plants. Lilina, did I not give Lilina boots? Oh, I guess I'm not. Whoops. Uh, I'll deal with that in the next map actually. Because I kind of need to decide who I'm bringing to like the final final chapters because we can only bring eight. Yeah. Eight which is excluding um, Roy and Faye who are necessary for the next two maps. The next. The last two maps. Sorry. 
Who hasn't moved? Just Tate? Okay. As I suspected... So, looking back through the footage, Soul's speed was 22, and Chad's was 20. So, how did Soul double Chad when the game's mechanics would not have let that happen otherwise? The game just wanted me to lose a unit. If I had to lose anybody... If I had to lose anybody... I'm kinda glad it was Chad. Um... I know that sucks to say... But... Like, other than the silver sword that Chad had... There's not really much other use for him. In fact, I can even tell you what the three things were. Um, and there was only one thing I really wanted, so I really shouldn't have brought him anyway. Um, yeah. On this side was a Sleep Staff, uh, a White Drem, and an Osferatu. And on this side, uh, even though we can't get them, is a Worm Slayer, a Dragon Shield, which is actually pretty good, and a Sword Reaver. Uh, let's actually do this. And then, 846, yeah. Come here, do this. Thank you, Zeiss. Much appreciated. Even though you are slow as hell, you can still destroy people. Maybe that's, <laughs> maybe they'll get the support finally in this map, because I know they have one. Oh, wait, you're equipped with the sword, right? Okay, whew. Uh, this side. Soul's still gonna be a pain for a good while. So let's equip stuff that equip that high heightens a void. Uh, even though I need to heal, Shh, not Sean. I need to heal Tate. Sorry. Let's move you guys away from this wall because he has uh, scary magic and scary magic. Can you reach the way up? Yeah, you can. Do I want you to, though? Because he can hit you if you do. No, I don't want that. Let's do this. Oh, I forgot to change. Is that the highest avoid? Yes, it is. I should have changed your weapon, but you have the sword equipped anyway, so you're fine. Uh... Okay, so let's do this to assume that you're equipped with that. Then let's heal. Who really trying to play the smart, because I really don't, like, we have to deal with, what, another three turns of Soul being berserked? If we play it right, we should be okay. Should be. Uh, do I want to heal Melody? I kind of want to heal Fur. Let me sneeze. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. Oh, that really felt weird. Um, yeah, come here. I think we need to move Lance and Clarine. Let's see. You can't quite reach us yet. I think I'll put you here. Just, like, this is just kind of to be like, I don't know if he can hit me yet. He can't. Even if I had moved down that other space, he wouldn't have been able to hit me. That's fine. Oh, that's Physic. Yeah, let's heal Melody. Okay. Man, I really wish you had maxed magic, but not everyone can be Priscilla. Uh, Lilina, heal fur. Thank God, more than like Clarine and Saul can heal people. Uh, Gonzalez, come here. Keep that equipped. There's these guys up here that I'm kind of afraid of. Oh, but he has a silver axe equipped, so I'm not too afraid. Uh, Roy can stay. Roy's the only person who hasn't moved. Okay, he doubles Ray. That's kind of funny. Uh. <laughs> oh god, does that mean Ray's gonna die? Oh shit. <laughs> Damn it. Oh no. No one else on this side can heal. <sighs> I need to pick him up. I need to pick him up. Thank god you can do that, right? Whew, okay. I need to pick him up to save him. Um, but then I also can't really move that far away. Yeah, Q. 
keep that equipped. Uh, if Sin gets attacked by this guy, I'm more, I'm more okay with that than anything else, to be fair. Um, I think this should be Shana's job. Yeah, because Tate, Tate is the one I kind of have come to enjoy more, uh, like using as a unit. So I don't mind using Yigyal as, um, like fodder for it, you know. It would suck if you hit Shin, but you can't double him, is the thing. So that's okay, that's good at least, you can't double him. Uh, Deke? Yeah, come on in. That's not the best sword for this job though, is it? That might be. Let's see, what can Melody do? That's not a good choice. Eh, 23! With a 71% chance to hit is not bad. What about Zeiss? Oh, Zeiss can only hit with the Javelin now. Oh! Actually, let's do that, yeah. Let's hit him with the Javelin. Zeiss, calm down! <laughs> I understand that it's like an important map for you, but Jesus, dude! Did you max anything else? No, damn it. Uh, Melody, can you even reach? No, but Deke can. Wait. I forgot what his voice was like. Is this the switch? Nothing's happening. I'm gonna keep him there because I feel like I need to put someone else on the other switch. Yeah, let's not be a let's not be a little puss baby about this. Let's just move this. No, don't want to use hammer. At least not yet. Uh, even though everyone has legendary weapons, I just well most people. I just really want to be careful with them. This melody is the only person who hasn't moved yet. Uh, let's bring you through. Fuck, I'm happy you got the crit on him and not anyone else. Jesus. That's a good level up. <laughs> Which I'm glad for, for when, you know, he stops attacking us. But considering he's still in the mode of attacking us. <sighs> not too fond. Not too fond. But hey, double edged swords and all that. HP and skill, that's fine. Okay. Uh, but I, I have an idea of who I want to be, like, my final-ish mem- Like, my final-ish members of the team. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, mind you. I won't say that I am, like, 100% certain. Because I'm not. Um, but, like, the team is more or less set up. It's gonna look- Kind of similar to the last to the last team, but not entirely similar. Like there is quite a few distinct differences. Oh, <laughs> uh, one of them being, hey, uh, fun fact: Ray is not Canis. <laughs> no one can ever live up to the glory that is Canis, considering he could basically one-shot the dragon. I actually went and looked back at the footage to be like, hey, uh, why is he so good at this? And it just turned out, uh, Luna. Like, the way that Luna works is so broken that, yeah, he could have just, he could have just done it. It would have been fine. Like, he really could have just one-shot that dragon. Ooh, I have to consider you now, don't I? Yikes. I have to consider you, too. Ooh. Uh, Tate. Come here. Cook a sword. What's your speed now? Eleven. Ooh, that's... Not good. Rather it be 11 than, you know, having someone else die. Um, like Chad's already dead, so. <laughs> well, so now we've lost Dorothy, we've lost Chad. Oh, and we lost Rootga! I was like, I knew someone else died, but I forgot who it was. It was Rootga. God. He was, a, he's like a really good character, apparently, and he just kicked the bucket. <laughs> uh, oops. I may have, uh, 
I may have jumped the gun a little bit on that, but hey. I didn't realize where the save state was, because I had save stated beforehand, and I could have saved him. But I forgot. So, I forgot at the time. So... Put this little lens. Green, stick next to your boy. I think it should be... I'm gonna put Roy in range. Uh... Let's put him with the killing edge. Do that. Keep Lilina next to him. Yeah, like so. Gonzalez. Uh, far kind of in the back. Wendy in the middle. There we go. Is it just these two? I'm afraid to move Zeiss. Because if something spawns here, I want Zeiss to be able to, like, kill it. Which, saying that... Uh, actually, no, it's a good thing he's equipped with this javelin. Is that it? Yep. Okay. Final time you can hit something. And I'm pretty sure he'll heal next. Uh, heal. He'll recover next time. Hey, miss me with that shit. Hey! Whoa, hold on. 51% chance to crit. Roy, what happened? Are you okay? <laughs> when did you become disgustingly good? Okay, level 2. HP, strength, skill, speed, luck, def. Yo! Okay. Roy is suddenly so much better. Oh my god. That shouldn't have hit. <laughs> um, damn. I wish Roy always got that kind of level ups. God damn. Um, shit, dude. Uh, fuck. I'm sorry. I'm kind of like recovering right <laughs> now. That was really good. Um... If he crits, that would be an issue. Why is his crit so high? What the hell, dude? Calm down. Actually, which one of you is lower level? Tate is. So, Sin. Uh, I'm a little bit skeptical. Let's not use that. Let's use the silver. That kills. <laughs> sort of is. But then, see, here's the thing. Hand axes, um... The hand axe animation is not quite clear other than from the flip um so if he had got the crit i wouldn't know until it's too late on the bright side i can drop ray now like i can put him down and have him move around by himself that's a really good level up tate i fucking love you um soul come here i think recover is now necessary yes okay uh, drop. <laughs> you have a sword of crit, right? Okay, yeah. I can put you down here. This is fine. Check what's on this side now. It's just this guy. Man, I was kind of th banking on putting Chad here. Man. Oh well. Uh, Melody, come on down. Say hello to your friends. Zeiss and Deke stay where you are, just because I feel like you need to be there. Uh, who's low leveled? Oh, Gonzalez, definitely Gonzalez. Okay, and Roy, but you know, mostly Gonzalez. Come on down, boy. Uh, well, actually, hold on. Be careful, you, because you get wrecked by magic entirely. Ooh. Guess Roy has to come here. Roy has a light brand. Also, Binding Blade has two range. It's a really disgustingly powerful weapon. Um, I get why, considering uh, they took so long to promote him. But Jesus Christ, dude. Like, God, most games know to calm down by now. Uh, physic, anybody need it? Not really. Okay, wait. Wendy. Uh... Just these two? Yep. And I'm gonna save state now after this. Oh yeah, I healed Sin. I was I was like clenched up for a second, like, oh god, that's dangerous. But no, it's fine. We cool. Sin is okay. How many turns has it been? We've had this light brand for forever. 
Like, I swear we've had it forever. Because I was like, I don't want to break this! This could be really useful! And here we are, doing 10 damage to things. Though, to be fair, it makes Fenrir, like, not hit us. So... You know... Good choice. I made a good choice. I really wish we were able to get the rune sword from a uh, Narsian, though. Like, the dark magic sword. That would be really cool. But, alas... Uh... <laughs> uh... Let's... Kill. You don't double. I really want to use Eclipse on something and hope that it hits. I kind of want to use Apocalypse. I kind of want to see what it looks like, but that's a waste. Um... Let's just flux him, why not? Actually, I should've used Nosferatu. That would've been a free heal. Oh well. Level 7, HP, Magic, and Resistance. Yep. Uh, Sin... Well, 6, 10, 10. Just 6. Let's, let's, let's let you do this. Probably should have equipped you with the lance, actually, considering that that is a 42% chance to hit, and it probably would have hit if I wasn't, you know, if I was paying attention, sorry. Um, why does it- I swear, it sounds like something's, like, coming off my wall. It might just be my balls making weird sounds for some reason. Uh, wait, no, we said this, Gonzalez. Yep. <laughs> As expected. As expected. I'm actually gonna just... I'll just, I'll just do this. <laughs> this is fine. I mean, yeah, he can still hit Roy. I'm actually saying that. Let's do that. But yeah. Oh, uh, this side. I have to kind of decide who I want to, like, come right here. Should it just be the sisters? I think it should just be the sisters, but the thing is... Ah, uh, the sisters and Ray. Or well, one of the sisters and Ray. I think one of the sisters and Ray. Yeah, because... Um... Yeah, Shauna and Ray, I think, because uh, Shauna and Tate probably don't have effective ways to take down the general, whereas Ray could, and Ray has like magic and stuff. So if somebody spawned in that like hits from a range, I can just equip him with Nosferatu and he'll be decently safe. And then I think that's it. So let's end the turn. I forgot about you down there. I forgot about that berserker. Yikes! That could be bad. Especially because he has an axe. Oh, I hope it's not a hammer. It might be a brave axe, but I genuinely hope it's not a hammer. Because if he comes and attacks Wendy, Wendy's dead. And I love Wendy so much. You tried. Okay, he has a hand axe. That's fine. That's okay. I'll take that. What else did you have, though? Out of curiosity. Devil Axe! Okay! Dangerous! Dangerous, dangerous man! Uh, Fuzz, level 8, level 9, level 9, level 16, level 11, level 8, level 5, level 2. And he got the crit! Roy! I finally understand now! Roy is our boy! <laughs> it's finally happening! <laughs> Okay, level 3, HP, Luck, and Resistance. Could be better. Um, do this. Oh yeah, I should probably have mentioned, uh, Gonzalez is a boss to the war right now. Uh, Silver Axe, Killer Axe, Brave Axe, Armads, and a Hand Axe, just, just, you know, in case. It's kind of disgusting. Oh, I need to sneeze. Ooh, bless me again. Gosh, I don't know why that keeps happening. Ooh, let me not do that. Oh, you only have a physic. Nice, nice, cool, cool, cool. Uh, in which case... Uh, hand axe, yeah. Ooh, 
I should really keep some tissues on me. La, 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 la. I don't know what to do now. Uh, what turn are we on? Turn 10. This turn, things are going to start spawning in that can attack us. So, we need to be careful about that. Okay, do that. Yeah. This. Okay. Right, I was just speeding up. Sorry. I need to stop. I should have healed fast. Out of curiosity. <laughs> it's just seeing that 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 one little bit like yeah you tried <laughs> like yeah we, we get it you tried but eh, it didn't really work out the way you wanted it to did it uh, we just need to deal with that bow user ooh what do you have mister you have a silence uh oh <laughs> Actually, melody yeah you come on down melody you come deal with this guy you guys are cool there they are! Hello! What do you guys have? <laughs> right, it's a longbow. It's a shame it does nothing to Melody. Uh... What do they do? Divine. Okay. <laughs> it's just seeing Soul be like, You really think that will work? Come on. I, I use light magic too. It means nothing to me. Come on. Uh, come on. <laughs> That's fine, honestly. I'm actually okay with that. Because it just means that, you know... Actually, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> Even though he probably needs the most, uh... The most care right now while he's asleep. I do not care. Uh... If... Currently, my mindset is like, if he was gonna get hit, he would have been hit. Uh... Or like if somebody was to spawn from there, they would have spawned in that moment. And it seems like no one was spawning in. So, you know. Well, I'll skip it. Damn it, I missed. Oh my god. Twice? Come on, Wendy, I thought we were past this. But to be fair, you had like 60% hit rate for like half of your lifespan, so. Oh, you only have steps. Interesting. I have to pay attention to that bow, but interesting. Uh... <laughs> Melina, come next to your boy. Gonzalez, come next to your boy. Lance. Corrine. I'll use Lilina to heal Roy. Because he's, he's not fully he's not full health. I kind of want him to be. Kill him? Yeah, boy! Yeah, boy! Hey, that's that that's my boy Sin right there. That's my boy! Okay. 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 I'm kinda hype. I'm kinda hype. We're nearly there. See ya. <laughs> God, I wonder if I can get. Clarine and Saul max level by the end of this. Because I know no one was max level by the end of, uh... I know no one was max level by the end of Blazing Sword. Cl uh, not Clarine. Priscilla got close. I think Clarine... Uh... God. I think Priscilla got up to, like, 16, 17? Or maybe... No, I think Fiora actually hit level 20 in the last map. I think. Because I remember Fiora being disgustingly good. Like, there was no competition between her and Florina to me. Whereas, this time, it's like, ah, oh, there is actually a, a debate between both, uh, both Pegasus Knight sisters that can actually do stuff. That's rude. How dare you try that? I'm skipping past that because the one time, the one time you decide to try it is immediately after she gets hit. Nah, son. That's, that's you. That's a you problem. You need to go. Bye bye. Oh boy. How long has this been going on for? 
Doesn't feel like it's been going on for long, but... Ah, uh, I mean, it's getting close to an hour. Um... Yeah, I don't want to put any next to the thing anymore. I'm gonna... You heal Roy, Clarine will heal you. Put Lance on this side. Yeah, Lance and Clarine like that. Oh, uh, let's move Gonzalez here. Yeah. That'll be an interesting way to, to enter this area. Kill him. Do it, Ray. Just do it. Okay. I looked at Ray's um I looked at Canis's colors the other day. Uh I like black and purple more than I like blue and green. It kind of sucks that Ray's color palette is so blue. Because if it was black and green, like, or like purple and green, that would be really nice and really cool. Like, I mean, look at his robes in his picture. They're kind of purple. So purple and green would be nice, but his thing is so blue. Oh, like, it makes me sad. I mean, I could keep units up here because I feel like these guys are just going to keep on spawning in. But, do I really want to? No. <laughs> I do not. So, not my issue. In fact, actually, let's pick up Saul. Let's just make this a bit quicker. Yeah. And then, Lilina there. bit of a waste but you know let's just make sure everyone's like more or less full health before they come into this <laughs> but I think and then Wendy down here we're nearly here we just need to work on this side let's try a clip ah oh, can you not reach from there I guess not. Man, that sucks. Okay, let's see. What can you actually do? Because if I didn't need to bring... Yeah, I kind of needed to bring Ray. Um, God. Let's just put you there. Oh, Melody. Whoops. Forgot about you. Anyone else? Deke's still asleep? That's fine. Binding Blade equipped right now. I need it to be equipped to open the door. That's fine. Anybody who needs to be healed real quick, Wendy does. Just one last top up. Ah, oh, that leveled up Clarine to 17! Wow, so, uh, Clarine might actually... And she actually got uh, stats up that time. Ooh, two stats, two stats maxed. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Uh, Clarine might not have maximum magic, but <laughs> she's got everything else pretty much down pat. Uh, I feel like I got a little unlucky. I either got really unlucky with her magic level ups, or I got really lucky with Priscilla's. But I know that the growth rates between this game and Fire Emblem, Six and Fire Emblem 7 are quite different, so... I mean, should've known, I should've known. Yeah, that's fine, come and attack me, honestly. Uh, because I want you out of my way. Thank you. Yeah. It might be overkill, but do it. Yeah, boy, thank you. That was exactly what I wanted. Level up for Sin. Let's see. Level 11. HP. I mean, 
you know, getting to 50, I'll, I'll accept that. It's 50 HP. That's Trap Soul now. Melody, come on over. Well, Melody can, like, chill with Zeiss, who can, I guess, chill on this side. Uh... Wendy will come here. Soul will come here. Yeah. Yeah. This guy's. I was, I was like, I knew, I knew I didn't do something that I should have been paying attention to. That doesn't do anything. That kills. I'll take this. Thank you. Man, I really wish it was purple and green and not blue and green. But then, like, uh, I don't know. Maybe the purple would have been too overpowering, or would have made the green pop out a bit too much, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not exactly one to, to, to know what a color palette's supposed to look like, you know. But let's, 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 let's heal Clarine. Why not? Why not? Clarine's not done any fighting this map. This is the first time Clarine, like, the first time in a while Clarine has been a designated healer. Um, and then that's it, so let's end the turn. Those guys have spawned in now. What do you guys have? Because you have to be able to hit us, right? He just woke up! Okay, <laughs> I was about to say, he just woke up, leave the boy be! Oh, hello. Uh... I kind of forgot about thieves, even though Chad just died. Chad has been really useful, so I kind of feel like, I do feel kind of bad that he's dead. But at the same time, like, what can you do? It's kind of expected. Like, he couldn't have stayed alive forever, especially because his, his class kind of has, like, his class kind of has a death date, to be fair. Uh... Okay, can you at least eclipse this guy? God damn it! Okay. He has a sword equipped, right? Yes. In which case, you want the Silomite equipped. Do this. Go! Wow, he is on par with your speed because you did not- you were not able to, to crit him. Not crit him. Outspeed him, sorry. I mean, it's not gonna hit, but- but if it does. One day it will hit. One day. Whoops. Is that it? Everyone who's... Okay, yep. Actually, this sleep thing might be a bit of an issue, because I don't know whether I have to hit them on the same turn. Oh, you have silence instead. Interesting. Ooh, he doubles you no matter what you do. That's great. Mmm. That's lovely. Oh, okay. Well, this is fine. We'll do this. And then we'll hit with, uh, Yigyal. Yigyal Shana. Let's go. That doesn't kill. Crit, maybe? Please? Okay, that's a tad bit of an issue. Oh, and it's a javelin instead. Oh no, that is a bit of an issue. What is it? He's doing 12 damage to you. You can survive another two hits. Oh, this side doesn't quite look the way I want it to. That's better. Then Shauna, if she ever makes it back, can come here and all that jazz. <sighs> and <sighs> okay, this is fine. This is okay. Level eight. 
HP, speed, luck, and resistance. We'll take the speed. You fool! You think 5% will work on me? That's basically, like, no percentage at all. Uh, gosh. I can't heal and wait on this thing at the same time, can I? I mean, that healed her the whole way. What's, is this the switch? Nothing's happening. Yeah, I have to wait for him to wake up. God damn it. Okay, in which case, Shauna, come make your way. Make your way downtown. Walking fast, faces passing, I'm homebound. I might actually just skip past this part, because this is going to be kind of slow. Uh, nope. I want to come to Shauna. Let's go here. I need to wait until Deke wakes up. Uh, which is in another... Whoops. Another two turns. They can just waste their staves, honestly. That's that's on them, really. It's not us. It's not our fault. Oops. Wait. I should probably uh, put on, like, Cursor Reminder. Ah, okay. Well, now I can do it. So, Shauna, just keep making your way. But... You wait on there, you wait on there, and then equip the Binding Blade. There it is! You've come. <laughs> it's laughable, really. A mere child making it so far. Zephyl, King of Burn, why did you start this war? I wish to end the Age of Man. I don't understand. Humans filthy and despicable creatures. They flocked to the promise of power like hideous, hairless sheep, and they stab trusted allies while their backs are turned. I'm certain you have witnessed such acts in your travels. Jealousy, hatred, greed. Friends and family are driven to murder one another by these petty emotions. Such emotions spawn fathers who would even kill their own brood. As long as humans control, as long as humans dictate, as long as humans exist, this madness will never end. But consider what you've done! You've become exactly that which you despise! Do you know how the scouring ended? The demon dragon was defeated by Hartnett. Yes. It was history's greatest mistake. Mankind should not have won. After the humans' ill-gotten victory, they perverted this world into an orderous cesspool of madness and evil. All through their illogical and contemptible emotions. Mistakes cannot be left uncorrected. I will return the world to the dragons. I will liberate it from the gnarled grasp of man. The slate will be wiped clean. History will be rewritten. It is the only way to free the world from everlasting agony. Is it true that you resurrected the demon dragon? There is no need to answer that. You will know for yourself before long. You said you intend to give the world to the dragons. How would rule by dragons be any different? The dragons you have seen are weapons. Uh, the dragons you have seen are weapons for battle. They have no self. They lack reprehensible emotions to drive them, unlike humans. The dragons' rule will be just and peaceful. Such a world can't be a better alternative. Some humans may commit terrible atrocities, but it has always been other humans who have stopped them. Your naivety amuses me. You have lost faith in humanity and in yourself. I believe in mankind, and I know that your lunacy must be stopped. Hello! Uh, hi! <laughs> God damn it. Okay, they're gonna make their way through. Uh, what's Shauna? Oh, okay. So, what? The first things we're dealing with is a Lance Reaver goo dude and a Soul Reaver dude. Then we've got Fenrir. Ooh, yeah, I was right. We got some manikeets in here. Ooh, look at Zephyr Sprite. Divine cover. Silver bow. You need to go. Uh, Fenrir. Damn. Okay. Uh, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I have a Lance Reaver. You don't. If I move Lilina back. Bring Lance here. And put Gonzalez here. 
then when the heroes come to attack, like, you know, they're kind of screwed. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Oh, more have spawned in. Oh, the Manakeets move! That's always good. Mmm, such nice and loving stuff. Oh, we get to see what the Binding Blade looks like, though. Ooh! Oh, you don't double with it, though. Is it too heavy? It might be too heavy. Oh, you have a hammer. That's cute. <laughs> you think a hammer will work on Gonzalez? He is made from hammers! His entire body is hammer. In all else fails, hammer. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's see. Okay, interesting. They did the old uh, switcheroo. Which means the Lance River's gonna go for Lance. Yep. To be fair, in my defense, I did not expect the AI to be that clever. <laughs> um, shit, though. Uh, I now need Melody and Zeiss, I think, to deal with that. These guys scare me. We need to deal with the Manakeets first. Like that that's that's a definite. The Manak the Manakeets have to go. Um Damn, dude. Okay. Yeah, the Manakeets have to go, but uh Damn. Oh, I'm skipping past this. That that's not an important fight. Um You're asleep, Deke. God damn it. We need to deal with these guys first, but we can't move in because, well, if we use Melody, oh, they finally have the support. Sick. Uh, actually, no. Let's use let's use Wendy. If we use Wendy, do that. I wasn't gonna watch that miss twice if it was going to. Now that means Lance. Gonzalez and Roy, who all have legendary weapons, can come in and deal with the... Assuming that this works, it does. Oh my god. Um... But we also have to deal with these guys first. So let's move Gonzalez, I think. If we move Gonzalez, use Armads on this dragon, who is about to get completely obliterated. Yeah, because we have flying units. Yeah, this might work. Okay. Ooh, might not work, actually. Well, actually, Fur can come around and hit one of these guys, so I think that's okay. Uh, Gonzalez? Let's have you use our mods on this guy. Aww, the weapon doesn't change! It does that, but it doesn't, like, change the look of the weapon or anything. That kind of sucks. Like, at least when, uh, Hector had Armads, it, like, was a gigantic axe. It, like, dropped to the ground when he went when he went to use it. Ooh. You're not strong enough to kill him in one hit. I don't want to use Lilina, though. Oh, right, Sin. I was like, hmm, how, what, what, what do? Yeah, Sin. <laughs> The only issue now is that, like, they're all equipped with their legendary weapons, so if someone decides to attack them, it's uses that are kind of going to waste. But, ignoring that, generally this is a good idea. Like what I'm doing right now. Because then we can... This guy has more damage on him, I think. Yeah. Silver Blade? Nah, that's too risky. It's too heavy. Yigel Foe with that 63% chance to crit. Damn. Damn! Level 9, HP, skill, and speed. That's fine. Uh, ooh. Right, a few people do need healing, kind of. Um, and there's people up there. Right, don't want to forget about these guys. Oh, kind of already forgot about them, so it's already a bit of an issue. Um, unless... 
Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. That kills. Okay, cool. That works, that's fine, that kills. We have a another bow user and a guy up there, which do suck. It does, like, suck for us. But... Oh, should I use the hand axe? Uh, that's too risky. Silver blade? Silver sword? Yeah, silver sword. Ow. Rude. Unappreciated. But this is what we have to do before we even think about hitting Zephyr. Echo sucks. Usable only by the King of Burn. 1 to 2 range, 15 might, it does 39 damage. And he has a hero quest for some reason. 24, 20, 14, 15, 22, 24. Ooh, I really want to see what Roy can do to him. It's not going to be possible yet. Um. Oh, wait. You have the Saint Staff. Okay, okay, we don't have to worry. Well, to be fair, we don't really need to use that. Like looking at the damage that is actually on people, but hey, it's an it's an option. Uh, how much damage does he do to you? He does 33 if he hits. So we have to find a way to make him unable to hit. That doesn't kill. Okay, it hit. God damn it. Okay. Melody though, I bet Melody can take this better. Yeah, for sure. Uh, for one, she actually, like, you know, um, can dodge that if it decides to try and hit. So let's see. This is such a cool animation. It's so long, but it's a cool animation. I mean, it's no, um, whatever the hell Nurgle had. Like, whatever the hell that was called. I don't remember what it was called, I just remember it was disgustingly powerful. Uh, Zeiss needs to be healed. So, Saw, come on up. Recover. Ah, oh, wrong person. Wrong, 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 wrong person. Um, shit. This has to work. Ooh! Mmm! Does anybody on this level need to be healed? No? Okay, Lovena. Can you four blaze him? Does that kill? No. Hellfire, air caliber. Okay. Can I rescue Zeiss? I can! By <laughs> just about. But I don't I really don't want him to get hit by that bow. Can he even get hit by that bow? Yeah, he can, he can. I mean, okay, to be fair, I don't know why I'm worried about him being hit by the bow, but I'm afraid that if more things spawn in, they'll be able to reach him. So I'm gonna rescue him. Just in case something else spawns in. Which it didn't. Okay, interesting. Okay, well now, Lilina needs to be healed. Okay, let's just get past this. You went to attack Melody, but missed. Thank God. Okay, Shauna dealt with you. I forget that I can move uh, Ray and Deke. Um, well, I moved Ray, but Deke's still asleep, right? Like, he kind of can't move. Shauna. Yeah, Deke's still asleep. He's kind of screwed. Um,. Wendy, come in. Obliterate. Okay. 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 We are so close to dealing with Zephyr. Ooh. 
Wow, that is unfair. Um, damn. Okay. Let, let's drop Zephyr first, I think. Not Zephyr, let's drop Zeiss first, sorry. Whoa, what was that? The entire floor just shaking. Nobody's in the house, so I don't know why my entire floor just shook. That's real weird. Um, I'm going to safely assume that it's nothing and continue on my merry way. Heal up, Lilina. Perhaps I should have come with a. Perhaps I should have come with an armor slayer. Well, I think Far has one, right? Yeah, Far do does have an armor slayer. And the Durandal! I forgot I gave you that. Uh, Melody needs to stick next to Zeiss, especially because they have a support! Zeiss, behind you! <laughs> Blast! I'm sorry, Melody. I was too focused on the enemies in front of me. Don't worry about it. Gail often looked out for me like this, too. If we can survive by helping each other out, then that's fine by me. But I need to learn how to defend myself on my own. You're still inexperienced. It's alright. Watch your back until you're strong enough. Thanks. But no, I can't accept that. I must become strong enough to protect her, too. Aww. That's cute. I like that these guys have, like, a... Uh... I am... Like, your sister and I want to protect you, or I am your brother and I want to protect you. I like that. It's a nice, it's a nice, uh, dynamic. Okay. It's just Rory hasn't moved, that's fine. Let's get past these guys. Unimportant. Okay. You have to be careful, because I'm about to move Shauna. Can these guys reach? If I put Shauna there, yes. Can she even reach there? No! Oh, but she's about to get into some pretty dangerous fights, so... Same with Ray, actually. Best chance, why not? Come on. Just once, just once. Damn it! Okay. Um... In which case, can we even hit Zephyr from this side? No. Only... You can only attack him from the front. That has no chance of hitting. Right, because Ekasox is a sword, right? Yes. It's weird that it's a sword, but it's a sword. Uh, Honest Leia. Interesting. Good to know. Uh, Lilina. Oh my... God, his damage is too much. His damage is actually too much for the universe. Um. Okay, so Soul. Wendy has to try and get in in this. I mean, it's so nice that the game kind of gives you a, hey, uh, here's the closest you can get before getting hit thing. Like, for once in its life, it tells you. I'm so scared. I don't know what I can do, is the thing. There's like nothing I can do. I mean, that's an option, but it's not the best option, you know? That might work! But I don't know. Uh, Zeiss, you have a Killer Axe, right? A Killer Lance, sorry, yes, you do. Okay, so I think the killer weapons, or the legendary weapons, are probably the best bet here. Yeah. Okay. Just take, end the turn. Oh, of course! Oh, thank god you missed. Okay. For once, Lilina having four blades on, which I forgot was a thing that she had on, was a good thing. Only HP, that's fine. I'm terrified now. Skipping past it because I don't want to watch everybody move. Okay, that missed. Sword can kill him. God. Then there's the people at the top. 
Level up the soul, level 15, HP and magic. That magic might be really useful right now. Oh, oh that's Zeiss as well. Oh no. Oh god, okay. Okay, 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 okay. We need to heal Zeiss! Oh, uh, Tate. Kill this guy, please and thank you. Oh my god, you got the crit too. <sighs> okay, Wendy, how useful are you here? Not very, sadly. So, since that's the case... Okay. Thing is, Roy's not very useful either. The Binding Blade does 11, which isn't bad, but it's not, you know... I'm gonna kill you levels, you know? Like, it's not gonna... I mean, it protects him from dying. Like, immediately, but... Damn. Damn. Okay. But... If you were to use the your Killing Edge, you'd do no damage to him. And he'd kill you next turn. That's something I'll consider. That is definitely a consideration. God, why is he so powerful? I just have to rush it. I just have to rush it. I just have to rush it. You shall not bar my path. Oh! What? What? No! No! Now in my remains Are promises that never came I haven't safe stated this entire map. I haven't safe stated this entire map. I just lost one of my best units to a 7% crit! Roy has to be the one to end it. Roy has to be the one to end it. I will not be happy unless Roy is the one who kills this man. Because he just killed my best, like, not my best, but one of my best fucking units. You wanna know what the worst part is? I think Roy is the only person who can hit him for decent damage right now. Because even if I try to use Zeiss, Zeiss will die, even if I try to use a melody. I don't know, if I attack him from a range, does it still do the same amount? It does. I have to put Zeiss though. It's dangerous, but I have to move Zeiss. What's that support? That's... Okay. I don't know what that does. Hopefully... I think that affected hit rate and crit chance actually. That might be really useful. <sighs> I 
I'm mad. I'm genuinely pissed. What, they don't even have a conversation together? That's boring. Out of curiosity, since he's died and he had the legendary weapon on him, does that make this the end of the game? Because if it does, I'm gonna reset and redo the map off screen. I won't even show the credits if it ends here. Because I'll redo the map. I know that means that Sin will be alive. But I've been saying, oh yeah, we'll get we'll do the finale. Like we'll do the actual end of the game. And I'm sticking to that word. So God Deke, you've been asleep for so long. Um God damn, dude. I know I'm putting off the inevitable here. Fuck off! Sorry. I know I'm delaying the inevitable. Because I feel that someone else is about to die right now. You know what, Lilina? Don't crit. Don't crit. I want him to burn at the hands of Roy and no one else. Yeah, go surround Deke. See if he cares. He's asleep, yeah, but like, damn. Fuck. I really wish I had safe state the whole time. In this world, there are only fools. And this one map killed three units. Two of them at the very end. I'm... I'm not okay with Ray dying, but I'm more okay with it than having your boy Sin die, you know? Oh, you know, fucking move out the way, Melody. Move out the fucking way, I'm sorry. Uh, Lance. Well, Zeiss, come here. Lance, come here. I'm, I'm overkilling this. I am definitely overkilling this. I don't care. Fuck you, Zephyr. Burn in the hell you came from, you piece of shit. I am defeated. But remember this. My will shall never die. As long as humans retain control, madness will reign. Bye bye motherfucker! I don't care, I don't care. I'm not watching. Is Lance about to die? Deke died too! Fucking lovely! That's cool! Um... Fuck. Shit, that's the end of the game. No, mm -mm, no, no, it's not. No, stop. Stop it. Where are we? We are really early into the map here. But, no, mm -mm, I don't care. I don't care. This is an odd place to end it, I know. Um, in fact, this isn't where I'm going to end it. I'll redo the map right now. Sin will be alive. I don't know if anyone else will. Um, well, actually, Ray has to be alive as well, because Ray had a legendary weapon too. But, you know, that happened. I'm not happy that that happened. At all. So, instead of ranting, I'll just go. 
I'll deal with it and I'll show you what's actually supposed to happen. So I'm back. Um, I have just been given the greatest news. Um, during, like, because I basically had to do the whole map again. Uh, Roy, in two levels, got enough speed to outrun Zephyr. Therefore meaning, right here, right now, Zephyr's about to get destroyed. Uh, Ray's still alive, ow. Uh, Ray's still alive, Sin's still alive. In fact, actually everyone, uh, is still alive. But, let's be honest here, um, I'm not really gonna be using Chad either which way. I did get him to open the chests here. Um, Ray might be in a bit of trouble right now. I genuinely hope he doesn't die though, cause if he has to die and I have to do this all over again, I'm gonna be angry. Um, I'm still not, still not happy that uh, Zephyr killed your boy over here. I'm skipping past this. I don't care what happens as long as nobody dies. Uh, Soul didn't die. Your boy didn't die. In fact, let's see this level up real quick. HP, magic, skill, speed, and resistance. Let's go. Come on, what else? What else you got? Come on, show me. Yeah, uh-huh. Okay, you had a silver bow. What else? Okay. Cool, you tried. And you? Oh, interesting. You tried too. Hmm. Uh, it's a damn shame that, uh, you know, you can do that all you want, but we're done. We're done. Fuck you. Zephyr has fallen. We've done it, Lord Roy. Or have we? What? What do you mean? The Dark Priestess is nowhere to be found. She must have escaped. So it seems. Whoa! What? What was that? Zephyr's sword. Glowed. It's... Exa... Exax... Exax... I don't know. A sword that only the King of Burn can use. Lord Roy! Legend says that when all the legendary weapons come together, the Dragon Sanctuary will rise from the ground! The Dragon Sanctuary? It's the headquarters and lair of the dragons. That's what the legends say, anyway. Yes, I've heard that too. Does that mean Ekisox is the final legendary weapon? I thought it was the Binding Blade. The Binding Blade may be on an even higher level than the legendary weapons. It may be its own entity, beyond compared to even the legendary weapons. More powerful than the legendary weapons. What power lies in the sword? Apparently enough that your defense and resistance are boosted by five. That's kind of broken. The sword is glowing again. The light is pointing to the south. Follow the Jesus light. The light lead us to the dragon sanctuary? That is how the stories go. The dark priestess is the demon dragon as we suspect. And she is most likely at the sanctuary. Very well. We follow the light. God! Oh! Deke, okay. So here's what I'm gonna say. Deke and Chad, I'm gonna consider as dead. Because they didn't have legendary weapons on them, and they died. So, to me, they're dead. I'm not gonna be using them anymore. Ray and Sin are alive on the basis that their legendary weapons were necessary to continue on. Um, I know that, I know that's kind of shitty. I'll admit, kind of shitty of me, but, oh, I'm sorry. This, th that was a pain. That was a pain. But we're done. That's the end of that. Thank you so very much for watching. If you liked this episode, thank you very much. Hopefully there are other things on this channel you can enjoy. If you didn't like this episode, I am so very sorry. But once again, hopefully there is something on my channel you can enjoy. I hope you... Uh, I was saying that way too quickly. I hope you all have a very nice day. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.